finally we're going to Tupata, guys. I can't wait. Tonight we are off. But this time around, we are going on our own boat, MY Gypsy, that me and Chris have been building or finished building for the last three years. Operational now for about a couple of weeks, few trips here and there. The crew is ready, the boat is ready, engine, equipment, food, chef, captains. We hired actually another captain and another engineer, so now we have four officers. I can't wait, guys. This is why we built this boat. Not just to go around beside us, which is my personally favorite, except Tupata, of course. But the main reason is that we want to go to Tupata. This is the premium of the premium dive site in the Philippines and on planet Earth. And that's not just only my opinion, it is actually, as you know, many of you know, it is declared the UNESCO World Heritage Site. When you see the biggest bill in the Philippines, Tupata is on that bill, representing Philippines. That is what we're going for. That is what we want to show the world, bring tourists around the globe to Philippines to see Tupataha. And lastly, I'm not sure how I'm gonna be filming much on this trip because this is mine and Chris' very first trip on the boat to Tupataha. So we have to be part of the crew. We have to be watching the guys. We have to see how everything operates, how the boat is functioning, how the chefs are doing with the guests. So let's see how much I'm gonna film on this trip. But I'm very sure on my next one, we go back to back. I will invite Sherlin to go with us. And that time we will of course film a lot more. But this trip, enjoy the highlights. I will film everything underwater. Let's go. Here we go. <laughs> First trip, let's go. <laughs> Our cruise began into the night. And waking up in the aqua paradise of Cagancillo for our checkup dives. Making sure our guests were ready for Tupata. That's it. We're going from Cagancillo now and uh, heading over to Tubata. It was a bit rough last night, but uh, thanks to the sea keeper, we were able to uh, go through it. We had over three meters of waves. You wouldn't believe it probably when you see the conditions right now. <laughs> it's unbelievable. But let's see tomorrow how the waves are. Anyways, a couple hours in the night and then we'll wake up in the south Anton. Tubada. Let's go. We arrived safely alone in the south end of South Atoll of the National Park at one of the most popular dive sites. Our number one goal was to spot the hammerhead sharks. How crazy was that? Not many places on planet Earth where you can witness all of that 
in the same dive site. First two dives done and hands down these are sort of the best dives I've ever done even topping the ones in the previous year Hammerheads, JT's, Groupers, Barracudas, Black Day, White Day, Jacks You name it, oh and a Nurse Shark, I've never seen a Nurse Shark before and He was pretty close so It's getting <laughs> the first two dives of the trip, I can't believe it Let's go So we continue diving the South A tool. Next two dives were the Staghorn Reef and Southwest Wall. Bear in mind that I was not using lights on these two dives so you won't see any color in the reef. Wait until later when I start filming with the lights on. Absolutely most incredible dives ever we've done here so far. So if there's any wind noise, but I want to share something. We got two ships here and they cannot attach to the mooring line that we are doing right now because of their size of the ship. Our ship is white bird glass and um, we can attach to any mooring line here in the park. So uh, the boats are attaching, we'll be safe and we don't have to be drifted in the ocean. Huge advantage we have on this boat. Even though we are only surrounded by sea, there's a lot to see. Like the endangered seabirds catching food. to the north. From above this reef is a sight to see. It's also here where the ranger station is located.
There's one thing you find ever in the Philippines, no matter where you no are. Matter where you are. Basketball court, <laughs> even in the water. <laughs> How amazing is that? Said goodbye to the rangers and danced into the night while welcoming the birds back home. In the morning, our first dive didn't disappoint. My favorite, Marble Stingray, gently greeted us. Finishing off a spectacular, very first My Gypsy to Bada trip ever. The journey has been incredibly long, about three years. Me and Chris have been working on the boat with a lot of highs and a lot of lows. And now we're at the peak, witnessing the very best of the Philippines in terms of marine biodiversity, nature, at the famous UNESCO site of Tubataha. Hard to put in words what we just witnessed here. We're able to have guests with us, enjoy the trip, have fun with us, experiencing it. They're behind the camera, we'll maybe show you a shot later. <laughs> They've been wonderful. Shout out to Megan, Nick, Lindsay, and Anthony, and Steve is over there. <laughs> 
Let's enjoy the beautiful sunset. It's a dream come true for me and Chris. And uh, two more trips in beautiful Tupataha. Stay tuned for the upcoming videos from Tubata as our season was just starting. It's only getting better from here. Thank you for watching. Enjoy the last clips from one of a kind Tupata National Park of the Philippines.